Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Black Hammer and thank you for watching this video. And as you see, we have something extremely special. This card right here, I just can't get enough of. Arcane for the bar man. And when I say this card is like a, a hop skipping away from being overpowered, I truly, truly mean it, especially after play testing this drone right here is like they're gonna have to ban this at, at some point because i can imagine how broken somebody else who is way smarter than me <laughs> utilizing this card right here um so so as you see i'm playing boros colors red and white and I, i'm not using the same tactic you know using the overpowered cards throwing them in the, in the graveyard and playing them almost like a reanimation um just play for cheaper we are going straight to the face we're doing what thor should have done in avengers endgame just go straight to the face don't hold nothing back and we are doing that with a whole bunch of burn so let's go ahead and go through the lineup real quick so we can get into the gameplay so of course we have four copies of arcane bombardment um on the last build i had three but on this one this card makes this whole entire build if we don't have this on the field yeah, yeah like you, you you might be able to do something but it's going to be extremely difficult so we need to have one on the field and if possible have a backup in our hand because you know people like to destroy enchantments nowadays people have no respect you know what i'm saying um but let's look at some of the cards that's going to assist us with winning so we got four copies of fierce retribution it's a two drop instant speed destroy target attacking creature you can go ahead and pay six i wouldn't recommend it but if you if you if you got it like that go ahead and pay six and you can just destroy target creature now i replaced this with the other two drop let me go ahead and show you real quick um i'm kind of having a brain for what it's called yeah fateful absence now this card right here i i had a bad experience with it like i kept telling you guys i would give my opponent that extra chance to draw something that they might need and lord behold yesterday i was in an intense game and my opponent had no cards in their hand they cracked the clue got a board wipe and whooped on me so i'm trying something different if it doesn't work <laughs> or if you guys don't mind to go ahead and replace four of the uh retribution but i just want to try something new uh we got three copies of uh, uh revitalize it's real simple you don't want to hit zero so go ahead gain three life and draw a card we have row eruption it's a two drop sorcery speed deal three damage to any target you can go ahead and kick it but no nine times out of ten i'm not kicking it i'm just going ahead doing straight damage uh with three and other than rip apart uh this one deals three damage to target creature or planeswalker or destroy target uh artifact or enchantment everything else hits to face now that's important because yes there's a lot of other two drop one drops that you know deal three four five damage to creatures or planeswalkers but if your opponent has no creatures or no planeswalkers and you have all these burn spells that can't hit to face then why you know what i'm saying like that's just wasted opportunity so if we got a set of four sorcery that does three damage to face or any target then we just have to do it uh same with uh call in a professional it's a three drop into speed can't gain life this turn damage can't be prevented this turn and deals three damage to any target easy then we got uh inspiration sorcery speed yes i know but it deals three damage to any target and you get to learn you get to learn something as long as you're paying attention uh, we got seven cards of you know various things that we could utilize in a tight game then we got three copies of unexpected one falls a four drop is the speed uh we all seen this card discard a card draw two cards create two tokens use those tokens wisely if we need to use those to ramp into arcane do so then we got two copies of doom scar um you can go ahead and maybe drop maybe a lord hold add in another doom scar if you just want to be sure that you can board white when you need to uh i think having two doom scars and uh three burn down the house 
is just enough. I really like Burn Down House because not only can you continuously <clears throat> do five damage to each creature and Planeswalker if you play it right, um, you can also use the second mode, which is create three one one red devil creature tokens. You can continuously, if you play your cards right, uh, just build up a board state just off this one card being under arcane. So, I mean, this build is pretty daggone sexy. And what makes it even sexier is we have two copies. Yep, two copies of Lore Hole Command. It's a five drop instant speed. Um, it's a five drop, so I kind of want to keep. I don't want to overpack my five drop, but um you have two options and if you know me and my content i love cards with options you get to choose to create a three two red and white spirit creature token uh creatures you control get a plus one plus zero gains indestructible and haste until end of turn so that works very well with uh creatures that you might get from a burn down house and then deal three damage to any target <laughs> once again and a uh, target player gains three life and last sacrifice a permanent then draw two cards so i mean if you got like 15 20 lands you know go ahead show one of those suckers and draw two cards uh also uh one thing that i learned for from uh play testing this build emerald's call if you utilize the sorcery uh half of this card and it's in your graveyard arcane can pick it up and you can abuse the hell out of this card i did that the other day i thought it was phenomenal and it, it definitely didn't treat me bad so now uh, we have 26 lands 27 if you count our uh not arcane our uh emerald's call so i mean this is a pretty pretty cool deck you know what i'm saying if you guys have any questions or tips definitely leave it down in the comments below let's have that conversation and once again it's your boy black hammer it's hammer time baby All right, so we are going first and we got a decent hand. So we're gonna go ahead and keep this here. Let's go ahead and play some hands and see how this deck does here. Ah. All right, blue white. Okay, I was definitely hoping it wasn't white. Girl. I am thick and of the type of white green and jackets. Blue white. Okay, uh, let's go ahead. Instant sorcery. I think we're gonna have to kill this. I don't know if I'm just being too paranoid. Like when I play control builds, I I, I might get a little like trigger happy. You know what I'm saying? I'm just like, no, it's a creature on the field. I gotta get it. You know what I'm saying? Like, well. Um, not sure exactly what maybe it's just okay so spell so he has four tails so it has to be a a tempo maybe whatever it is i mean these creatures are gonna have to die i mean it's <laughs> yeah might yeah let's go for it <clears throat> all right let's go ahead and get our three two and deal three damage a boom bada bang all right so if he has any bounce spells anything he should okay hmm. all right let's go ahead and throw our game this 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 is what we came to see right here he blocks cool if he doesn't he does he, he taking three to the face Um, what is he gonna take? Retribution, make that a what? A four drop? Okay, he takes a royal. And plays the angry raven. That's a big raven. That's a three, three. Uh, I mean, his land is cool. We, we, we need a little firepower now. All right, so let's go ahead. I think we need to target. Yeah, let's go ahead and get the flyers out the way. 
Because if anything, I can block the other two, but not. Yeah, I definitely can't block the fires for nothing. So, um, we'll go ahead and save retribution on our opponent's turn, so Arcane can trigger again for us on our opponent's turn. All right, so let's just go for it. We're gonna destroy you. What are we getting? Uh, deal three damage to creature and three damage to top. Oh my god, that is beautiful. How, how do you destroy two creatures and still have enough to deal three damage to face? That's ridiculous. All right. So let's go ahead, go up top, because that's all we can do at the moment. Come on, give me the orb hole. All right, I guess we'll do three more damage. Uh, this one will decline. That's all I keep hearing. All right, deal three more. What it was that? What three six? Three, uh, nine damage. Nine damage to face in one turn. It's pretty sweet. It's pretty beautiful. I'm so curious on what our opponent's doing here. He got a lot of birds. This is just like a bird deck. All right, burn out in the house. I don't know if we need to go that gangster right. We'll go ahead and create some uh, 33s. 33 demons. Ooh. Okay, there's the foretell. I was wondering what was going on, but I think it's a little too late now. Yeah, three damage, so take out you. You just gotta be real careful on how you manage all this, because it can get real confusing. Cheer, 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 cheer. Damn. Come on, take him out. Alright. That's game, baby. That's game, baby. That's how we do it. I mean, it's, it's, it's just the first game, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to get too excited. This happens to me all the time. I do one good game, and then I lose two in a row, three in a row. You know what I'm saying? So let me just temp temper it down just a little bit. Let's go to the next one and see how we do. Let's go. All right, our opponent goes first. I like it. I like it. I mean, it'd be even better if we had Arcane, of course. It just sets my mind at ease because even though we got four copies in our build, it's not a guarantee we'll see. It. There's green. Don't don't you do it. Don't. I told you I'm so. I don't know. Um, we're just gonna get rid of it. I'm I'm tired. I'm sick of the tired. I'm tired of being sick and I'm sick of being tired. I'm green and white. I swear if I see another enchantment creature, I'm gonna flip out. What are you doing? Are you creating the token? You're you're a big enough creature, bro. We're gonna go ahead. I, I, I know Mr. Hot Mulligan's got that some more. What you got? Okay. So maybe it's not enchantments. Some ramp. Uh, uh, let's see. Let's see. Oop, wrong one. Let's go ahead and just wipe out. Let's just go for it. I don't. That's seven damage. That'll put me down to ten. That's, that's cutting it a little too close. We don't even have arcane yet, though, so. But he does have that, too. Mm. Another planes, man. Another planes, bruh. Alright. This board was before you can create copies of cats. I don't even like cats like that. Thank you, sir. Let 
You know what? Free it. Let's go. Yeah. I mean, I know it's overkill. I know. I know. I get it. But, I mean, we can't allow him to establish anything just yet. Alright, let's gain three. Mm. See, this is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. Like, we can't allow our opponent to get the upper hand, especially if we don't have what we need. Because then we're going to so fall behind. So dumb. Come on, baby. We're gonna hold on to this lane because I think we're gonna discard that. Okay, our opponent doesn't play that. That's a good sign right there. We got four of these suckers, man. There it is. I was about to have a, a baby and a half right now. Come on. All right. I think we're good to pop off right now. Get the get out. All right, let's just go for it. Oh, God, that would have been. Hmm. Mm -mm. Man of five value or less. That's not bad. Burn down the house. Let's get the hold on. We don't need it right now, but. Let's go ahead and create some one more. We gotta try to. I'm pretty sure his deck can way overpower ours right now. So we gotta at least make it look like we're like applying some pressure. Yeah, that's gonna set up here. Do you see what I'm saying? Now I was saying he has a 7-7. Seven, seven. Game for oh, he didn't put okay. I mean, that's still annoying. And he's gonna take over. Wow. Okay. I, I see you now. Mm, mm, mm. All right, we have another burn barn. Thank you. Rob one has three of those joints up there, man. I'm gonna. This game was destined for us to lose. <laughs> like we were meant to lose this no matter what. All right, go ahead, block. Yep, and go. Oh. And go. All right. So now our opponent has a three. Three and a four four. We just have a whole bunch of one ones. Oh my gosh, are you kidding? Oh yeah. I thought you did that. That's crazy. This car has a flashback. That should not be that should not be a thing, man. Come on. Like and I'll defend it like one. Be brave. Five five in life. Maybe. I mean, yes. Mm. Oh, they all have trample now. So it doesn't make sense to just single block each one. We need to kill one of them. I think I want to get rid of the chair. I think that's gonna be more problematic. And I guess there's one extra homie. I guess I guess it doesn't really matter. But yeah, that's gonna do two. They die, does three damage. Okay. He's tapped out, so it's gonna be no surprise this or that. Down to seven, baby. <laughs> Alright, one, two. Yeah, I guess one of base. Oh man, this is stressful, man. I really rupture. I guess.
guess we can do one here. And if we can get... I guess that's cool. That'll work. Maybe we should have hit Elspeth. Elspeth. Maybe we should have hit her. She's about to be popping off real soon. Damn, did I mess up. Our opponent has no cards in hand. Let's do this together. Plus one. Oh, oh. oh my gosh. Oh, and then he's getting a what? How much is that? Oh my gosh. All right. So he he thinks it's over. I, I think he's sadly mistaken. So let's go ahead and trigger our game by getting rid of you. No, I was gonna get rid of the six six, but I mean, surprise, surprise, he has a an eleven eleven. So we're going to hit you, raise some more enemies. Kill you for sure. Black and black. So we're gonna take a little damage. Oh my god, three. Um Hold on, let's see. Oh she's at seven. Damn, I might have to. I think I have to. Let's, let's see here. Can we get... Ah, man, we need burn down the house, bro. All right. Let's do three damage to... Yeah, let's go ahead and finish you off. Three damage to Elspeth, because we don't want her to pop up. And I guess we'll some more angels. I mean, we're, we're just okay. as if this is an I angel. I guess I'll day. have to earn my answers. Yeah, you you gonna have to earn them, Michelle. Um, I don't want to give him nothing, bro. No artifacts we can destroy. Nah, he can't have nothing. Nah, we'll just we'll just get this. Thing too. We're gonna have to hold on to it though. Shoot, because it's not even guaranteed that we'll get you know instant sorcery speed next turn. We might just pull like three straight lands, you know what I'm saying? So we gotta we gotta use this just right here. This is your fight. He Wait. better give it uh, flying, right? Because uh, Elf Fifth Elf Fifth is gonna die. He's gonna be destroyed. So. First strike, three, three. Hmm. Let's go ahead, play our sorcery speed. Boom scar. No, I think we're, I think we're good on boom scar. Let's go ahead, do, do some more damage. Uh, it, Go right here. Damn, I probably should have. Um, I guess I could have hit the face with that. Damn, I'm making these, these little tiny mistakes, man. Can add up. up should have just hit the face. Oh my god. Got some more freaking cats, man. No attack, right? He'd be crazy to attack. Alright. Let's go ahead and create a 3 2 and 3 damage. 
guess get rid of a cat, right? I mean, my opponent has 28 lives, so it's not like we're in a rush right now. Let's go ahead, three two, three life here, or I mean three damage. We need to get rid of this guy and create some more. Damage. That'd be funny if I hit huge though. Bro, I'm getting too old for this. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all don't understand. Why was that so? I threw it down to three life. Who does that? Down to three life. And he has a titan of industry on the field. He has a, an 11 11. He has all the lands in the world. And I still find a way to over. All right, next game, we are going first. Thank God. This is a pretty. Decent hand. I like it. Um, a little on the expensive side, but I mean, as long as we can get our lands, that's part of the plan, baby. Yeah, I don't think everybody loves that. Two burn down houses. That's a little too much right now. Field trip. Gotcha. So he's ramping. I'm assuming it's a green white or green blue ramp. You know, uh your various big green blue features. He has what five lands? I mean he can do some damage with that. That's that's a lot of lands right now. Cultivator into your hand. Come on, to field. Wow. And another field trip. Oh my god, who is he trying to summon right now, bro? And damn, we gotta play in what's called. After this car single-handedly saved my life last game. Really didn't want to play that. Let's go ahead and get rid of you. And we miss a lamb. My gosh, we miss a lamb, bro. That's not Another cultivator, another land, four, eight, nine, ten lands. Our opponent has 10, 11 lands, and we managed to miss a land. This ain't going good at all. <laughs> and he searches for another land. All right, so let's go ahead and burn down the house. I, I will. Let's just go for it. You know what? Let's let's just do it. I mean, does he have a counter? Bro, let me. Thank you. Yeah, like he hasn't seen that car before. I know you. Ooh, there's Kuma. I knew. I forget. I forgot his name. I knew it was a big snake guy. Oh, this is what's up. I need to get rid of him. He gets. He gains indestructible when he has a serpent. So let's go ahead. Burn down the house. Oh, you bro. 
damage. Three. He gets to face, right? Because everyone else is going to die. He's going to sacrifice the serpent. So, yeah. Three to face. That would be crazy if he didn't sacrifice. Okay, there it is. Because then it would be like, I just missed out on a rare opportunity to kill both. But of course, he makes it indestructible, so. Oh, this is gonna be rough. Our opponent has a million cards, and he got a 7-7. Seven, seven. It's gonna sacrifice. But we need to do it anyway. Because that has ward and we have no attacks. Oh man, if we make it out of this one. Down to one. I've been here before. Alright, so let's go ahead, deal three damage, create a three, two. So before he can go ahead and create his token, we're going to. I mean, unless he has something in his hand. Come on, I think this is going through. Is it going through? Give me something. You gotta give me something. What it what is it? What's what's the deal? Oh no. It's over. Oh. Man, come on. It felt like I should have had that. I had some sort of like, I don't know, exile. Oh, that really sucked. But it's cool. It is cool. I think we, we had some pretty impressive games before this one. Let's go to the wrap up and let's talk about this build. Let's go. All right, guys. So we're here at the wrap up in this build. I'm a, you are you already know how I do it. I'm gonna keep it 100 with you guys. I'm gonna be completely honest, even though it's my build, and you know I think I'm the greatest out there. But I'm gonna be honest with you guys. This build is fun. Okay, check that off the list. Yes, it's fun. <laughs> um, can it you know beat decks? Yes, it can. I think it can even hang with some of the you know more meta decks. Now, is it a uh, a tier A, a tier S? No, only because, you know, obviously if I kind of played with it for another like two, three days, tweaked it as much as possible, um, buying some exile cards maybe to kind of get rid of some of the bigger creatures I can't do with, you know, just the damage itself. You know what I'm saying? I think that's probably the only thing because I don't want to spend <clears throat> you know two three cards just to get rid of one creature but other than that i mean you just gotta make sure you have the right cards at the right time maybe increase doom scar drop one of these you know drop one of those go in the extra one of these here uh maybe even drop and add in another one but like that i think something like this is pretty daggone good and I mean, I, I like this deck a lot. You know what I'm saying? I think it's worth crafting these cards. A lot of these cards are really old, but I mean, Bombardment hands down like 630 is a extremely powerful card. So if you, if you guys have anything to make this build better, let me know in the comments down below to have that conversation. 
And once again, it's your boy, Black Hammer. And I will see you guys in the next video right now. Peace.